hi, if it's morning where you are, whatever time of day it is, uh, it's morning here, so that's why I said morning. I hope you guys are doing well, uh, taking care of yourselves. This is, I feel like, a great time to focus more on just taking care of yourself, um, resetting whatever that means to you. Since I can't do any self-care outside of the house as far as like getting my hair done, I'm natural right now, um, getting my nails done, getting my eyebrows done. Skincare is one of the only things I have left to rely on to keep me feeling my best and looking my best. And if my skin is all together, then it is well with my soul. Uh, obviously, I've had a lot of time to do skincare and stuff. I did talk to you guys on my Instagram about a serum that I've been using by Ola. So this video is in partnership with Olay to share with you guys my updated thoughts and opinions on the new Tone Perfection Serum and how I incorporate it into my everyday routine. I wanted to just share with you guys my morning routine. I never talk about my morning routine. I always talk about my nighttime skincare, but never really talk about my morning routine. But before I get into that, I really quickly wanted to just like talk with you guys about serums because I feel like... As much as I talk about skincare, there are always new people coming to my channel and I don't think I've ever made a dedicated video specifically talking about serums, the power of serums, and why you need them in your skincare, skincare routine. Um, because if you don't use them, your skincare routine probably sucks. I always get this question, what is the one product, the one thing that changed your skincare routine out of all of the changes you've made to get your skin to where it is now. What has been the game changer for me is serums. If you don't have a good serum in your life, you're not gonna see the results that you're really looking for. And honestly, it depends on what results you're looking for. Multiple steps to a skincare routine, right? You got your cleanser, okay? That's how you wash your face. You know, you clean off all the dirt, the makeup. Then you go into a toner, you reset, you know, rebalance the skin, bring that pH balance back to your skin. And then there's the moisturizer at the end where you would put the moisture back into your skin so it's nice and hydrated, right? But then there's like that little middle ground area where some of us need more attention to specific things more than others. I don't have acne prone skin like I used to when I was younger, but I'm still prone to dark spots. So if I do break out, hyperpigmentation is one of my main struggles. You remember, if you used to watch my skincare videos before back in the day, like 2015, 2016, my skin was awful and my dark spots were really bad. All over here, all on the sides of my face and in my cheeks area, I had really bad dark spots. For you, it may be something else. You may have really dull skin and you need to brighten and bring some glow back to your skin. You may have really dry skin and you need to bring some hydration, like deep penetrating hydration. You may have skin that gets clogged really easily, is prone to pollution in the environment, things like that. That's where your serum would come in. So your serum is basically a very concentrated, potent liquid that is going to be that savior of your skincare routine. It's gonna provide the extra treatment for whatever it is that you wanna fix with your skin. It's gonna provide that for you. Now, of course, there are products that contain acne fighting, dark spot lightening, that in a face wash, in a toner, in a moisturizer that'll help. But what's really going to make the difference is the serum because the serum is going to deeply penetrate into your pores and really get the job done. So that's what the serum is for and that is why you need one. I was not using serums um, when I first started doing skincare routines. I wasn't using serums that much. I was really focused on face wash and I've learned that the face wash is actually not the most important part. It's like the first step, but everything after that is way more important. You need those vitamins, you need those nutrients being put back into your skin. Instead of just getting rid of stuff, you need to focus on what you're putting into your skin, okay? The beauty comes from within, the glow comes from within. Going back to the serum that I've been using, the Olay Tone Perfection Serum. Over the past few weeks, I've noticed my skin has been doing really, really well with it. My skin loves products like this. Like I said, I focus on tone and brightening, and this does exactly that. This serum contains vitamin B3, which is niacinamide, vitamin C, which is good for brightening and giving that youthful glow okay it's just gonna make your skin look really really glowy really really bright and lively it's also gonna help color discoloration problems hyperpigmentation and I do use the serum morning and night you can use it either or or both if you want um, but I always use the serum at night I focus heavily on serums at night that's where you're gonna see the most 
transformation in your skin when you're sleeping your skin does a lot of renewing a lot of body processes happen while you sleep which is why it's important to get your sleep okay that's number one and this is going to help increase the cell turnover rate in your skin and it's going to help with that rejuvenation process you know reducing the dark spots getting rid of those cells those dead cells and stuff on your skin surface you're gonna apply to clean skin after cleansing and toning and then you're gonna go in with your serum so in the morning I kind of do the same thing um, I don't do as much with my skin in the morning because I've already done so much at night and my skin is nice and rejuvenated when I wake up. I rinse my face off with cold water, wipe it off, and then, which I've already done, my face already feels dry because I just got out of the shower. But in the morning, I just like to use a little toner with a cotton pad and just wipe my face off and my pH balance is restored in my skin. So this is the Tone Perfection Serum, like I said, it's got the vitamin C in it, you know. So I like to take the dropper and just drop And the serum is at CVS, by the way. You can find it at CVS. I'll be sure to put a link in the description box to where you can find it. But yeah, I just like to work that into my skin. Um, it's not a super thick or heavy serum, so it does glide over the skin very nicely. It's very, very lightweight. It doesn't burn at all. It doesn't tingle. It's not irritating or anything like that. It's not gonna be too potent. So if you have sensitive skin, I believe you can use this because it's not going to be too harsh for you. So I just work that in with my fingertips and I just swirl it around on my skin. Whenever I put serums on my face, I do like to take my time. I always say this, let it marinate into your skin, you know, let it really sink in. Um, and I just like to give my skin a little bit of love. Like I'm at a spa and I'm getting getting a facial. Um, you know, when you get a facial, people, they move really, really gently and they, you know, massage your skin. And I like to do that with my skin every single day. It just helps with just feeling alive, you know? Yeah, that is the application. I'm gonna go in with a moisturizer. Highly, 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 highly recommend that you always wear a moisturizer with an SPF in it um, because that is going to help keep your skin bright and protected from the sun. If you have dark spots or you're prone to dark spots, you definitely wanna make sure you're wearing a sunscreen at all times, no matter what your skin tone is because your dark spots are not going to get lighter. They're not going to fade quickly if you are not protecting them from the sun, especially after you use vitamin C or any type of serum that helps with brightening in dark spots, okay? Okay, we don't want any issues with our skin. Always moisturize. Even if you are an oily girl, moisturize your skin, please. Okay, please. Thank you. So yeah, after you've applied your moisturizer and everything, you're done. Obviously, you can wear as much makeup as you want, sis, but the glow comes from within, okay? And if you're not using one of these brightening serums or any type of serum that works well for your skin, if you're not using a serum, you're not gonna get that glow from within. I just want y'all to know, like, the reason why your skincare is not working is because you haven't been using serums or you haven't been using the right one for your skin. Whatever you need in a serum, Olay has got you, okay? They have multiple different ones that you can check out, so be sure to check those out as well. I'll be sure to put a link in the description box to all of the serums so that you guys can check those out. Um, but this is the one that I love and I've been using for the past couple weeks and I recommend it. I found that vitamin C serums are my favorite type of serum thus far, other than, of course, like glycolic acid, lactic acid, things like that. Those are a little bit stronger and they'll help get rid of your dark spots faster. But as far as just like everyday maintenance, vitamin C is my go-to for my morning routine. So this one is amazing if you wanna try it. It's great for your budget too. It's not too expensive. And I think what I really loved about trying this Olay serum and working with them is that they have the Olay skin promise, which basically promises you that whatever they post, they're not going to retouch my skin at all. But I'm not gonna be retouching my skin in my photos either I wanted you guys to really see how glowy and amazing my skin looks after using this product if you guys saw my original promotion video yeah I did have some breakouts on this side of my face when I made that post and as you can see they're gone and no dark spots so shout out to the Olay serum for taking care of that because I was actually kind of mad about that I was like why I gotta have a breakout right when I'm about to post something about skincare but it's okay because I had to show y'all how it worked for me anyway so 
there you go. Yeah, I just wanted to talk to you guys, give you guys a little chat about serums and give you guys a little skin update. I haven't come on here barefaced in a while, so I figured this would be the perfect time. And that's it. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys want to see more skincare videos, trust me, I got plenty of skincare to try. I, this is really all I got to do right now is uh, play with skincare because um, and that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'll talk to you guys in my next one, all right?